Yeah. DC one and only. It's called Mind's Periscope. We have made it to Chula Vista City Hall. This is where we made it to. So we're gonna go in here, check and see if they respect our rights to film in public places. So far, it has been, uh, I guess, pretty good here. Uh, in Chula Vista, they seem to be aware of our rights. Um, <clears throat> the library, no issues. Nobody said nothing. Um, She waved at me. I feel special. I feel special. There's offices in here. Is this the entrance? Well, they got to be. Okay. Well, digital monitors and stuff. Public entrance. I guess it's the other door, I guess. Excuse me. I guess they draw the maps and documents out to here. So here's a pickup area. How you doing? Yeah, she told you you need to get a life. You need to get a life, man. I got a life. I'm, I'm doing this. This is my life. I'm blogging. I'm documenting. I'm telling a story. Okay, well, uh, let's head to the next spot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go follow her. I'm gonna go see uh, what's over this way and work our way around since it's, it looks like it's building C, building whatever. Um, it's like maybe four buildings here. I'm gonna go uh, record her because I need to get a life. <clears throat> Put on this path. <laughs> need to get that life. She saw us. She's running. She's running. Running like a trap star. Looks like she's on the phone calling the cops or something. I think she's calling somebody else. Who's talking to somebody else? Oh, yeah, yeah. Why is she running?
Boy, she running, isn't she? Yeah, let's go. Let's go engage with the cop. Let's go engage with the cop. Hey, yeah. No, he. She didn't. She didn't call him. He just showed up. When she saw him, she went running. So let's go engage. Hey, officer! I'm gonna go follow him. Look at she running, she running, she running like a trash star. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, she just she ran to a car. Oh my god, that's funny. <laughs> ah, she's so funny. Yeah, that was her. Yeah, she was so funny, man. <clears throat> hmm. That is cool. Look at this. They got the uh, a a built-in fan system. Before it probably came here. No, uh, I think this is a it's an unmarked car, but it has the you know the license plates. And uh, I don't know. I seen I seen like canine like units though with that to keep their dogs cool. I was told that um, <clears throat> by another officer that they usually keep the engine running with the AC on for the dogs. Yeah. Because okay, if it's a hot day, that shit ain't gonna cool nobody down. That shit gonna make somebody burn up. <laughs> See, she drove back up this way. Where did she go? Did she leave? I thought she did. I thought she pulled out from up over there. No, she, I saw her turn to go talk to the guy right there in the truck. <clears throat> but that was hilarious, man. She ran to her car. Huh? Yeah, she ran to that car. All right, let's finish our audit. Yeah, she ran. I was like, wow. <laughs> this is her right there. See? She's still there. Like, what is she doing? <laughs> oh, this is funny. Like, she ran, got in the car, and then turned around and drove around in a circle. Are you okay? I mean, you're running and you seem very paranoid. A little suspicious. Are you on drugs or anything? Have you been drinking? You don't work for the city. Are you not a city employee, are you? No? Okay. Well, I just don't want you to be drinking and driving, okay? <laughs> you gotta calm down. It's not that serious. Okay? 
relax. Woo, that's funny. Huh? Nothing, I wasn't talking to you. Oh, what, what happened? Nothing. <laughs> yeah, she's she's tweaking. How you doing? How's your day going by? Yet, we'll figure it out. Huh? I don't know yet, but we'll figure it out. That's not good, man. If you didn't wake up in good mood this morning. All right, take care, brother. He was asking me why I was filming. I said, because I can't. Oh. Yeah, she was doing, <laughs> look, top, she's so. still doing donuts in the parking lot. She's doing donuts. We got a, hey, we got a Karen. Yeah, we walk into funny. a Karen. <laughs> and that was a Darren right there. Because he said he was going to call the cops. Uh, well, he can do that. It won't help. She told him, say, there's one already on, on the place. <laughs> She's finally leaving. Yeah, really wow. I told her, I said, hey, she wrote her window down. To, hey, no, she's not. She, she wrote her window down, right, to can back me. And I said to her, I said, I said hey, are you okay? I said, so suspicious. I said, are you drinking? Are you doing any drugs? Oh, business license. Good morning, how are you doing today? Good. Uh, I don't need no help right now. Sorry, you guys can have phones inside. Is this a, not a, a public building? Okay. Is this a public Is this a public lobby for the people? That's your job to that's your job to cover that up. I, I'm not here to film and people's information. Yeah. Um I'm not here to film anybody's personal stuff. That's not here for. I'm here to check on our county buildings, make sure that everybody's happy as best as possible. You know, uh, I didn't know this was a business office. Yeah, it is. Sir. Yeah. So now that when I do my story, I can let everybody know that into the vista, here's a business office right here. Just in case people don't know. You know? All right, do you mind? Yes, sir. How you doing? Right. Yeah. Can you come in? Okay. You can go ahead. See, you you can show him. This is a public, public business or a public place. Yes. So there's a sign right here. Okay. Since you're recording. Okay, I'll give back. Okay, I'm coming. Hold on. You want to record this on? Yeah, yeah. That says turn off cell phones. Is there a penal code attached okay. to that? So we'll go ahead. Uh, you know what? I'm sure you'll look it up. Okay. So, <laughs> but if you don't mind, if we can ask you to go ahead and turn I, off your phones or leave that. the premises, that'd be nice. This is a public building ta okay. paid by taxpayers. Absolutely. This is a public space for people to come in, pay their bills. It says payments, buy licenses. Um, <clears throat> that sign is one of your policies. It's not a law. It's not a penal code. I'm not saying it is. I'm okay, just so asking. You know, I don't have to follow that. That's you don't for have to. You don't that's have for to. your staff to follow, but not me. No, no, that's for the public. No, it's however, not. however, because it's not a law. However, I will. But I appreciate you, brother. Thank you. Interesting. I think you found a good spot, man. <laughs> I had a question. What um, what business license can you get here? What business license are you we're, trying we're, to open? But yeah. we're we're not. We cannot be recorded. It, as it says, so are, are you guys not public employees? For, we can wait for PD to arrive. Do you work for the city? Do I work for the city? Yeah. Do you, are you are you a city employee? Yes. Okay. You can be recorded. Yeah. Not if we're being recorded. Yeah, you can. We're just going to wait for That's fine. PD to come and they'll be able to advise us. They'll we'll educate you. Yeah. Nothing, nothing trumps the Constitution of the First Amendment. Okay. No law can break the First Amendment. First Amendment free speech. Yeah, freedom of the press, right? You're not going Hey, I, I could have. <laughs> So, um, were you able to answer my question? Like, what kind of business license? If I wanted to start a business in Chula Vista, any type of business. If you're doing business within the city, you're eligible to apply. 
Okay, do you have paperwork that, that, that I need to get from here or anything? Oh, yeah, we have an application. Oh, thank you. Uh, How's everybody else doing today? We're just trying to get information okay. and disseminate it to the public. Thank you very much. Is this where you would also file a fictitious name? No. For a business? No. Is that a different location? That's with the county. Okay, okay. Because I know you got the one in downtown San Diego where you go file it at. But since Chula Vista, San Diego is different. Sure. Where would that county building be at out here in Chula Vista? It's on 3rd Avenue. Okay, okay. Well, thank you very much. Now, one more question for you. It doesn't say about what would be the initial fees. What is the fees to start to apply for a business out here? Depends on the type of business. Okay, let's say if I... Where it's located, if you're a sole proprietor, it depends. There's no flat rate fee. Okay, let's say that uh, I wanted to start a uh, liquor store. What would be the, the fees? A what type of business? A liquor store. It, it depends, because like I said, police has to approve. Um, yes, yes. It goes into a lot of things. There's no flat fee. Okay, so you guys don't carry, like, uh, <clears throat> in downtown San Diego, they actually have a list of all the licenses with the codes and everything, and they have the prices on that list that the people can see. You can go to our, um, we have a master tax schedule that you can go online. Okay. And, uh, let's see here. Okay, one more question for you. Um, when it comes to the cannabis businesses, is Chula Vista allowing cannabis shops to open up? Yes, it goes through an application process. Okay. Is there a certain number of shops they allow in Chula Vista? That they, they, they allow? Yeah. Yes, and you can get all the information. It's on our website. Okay. But you guys don't carry no, no, no regular paperwork for people to read like we this? Not. All of that's online. Okay. <clears throat> all right. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome. So since the police are called, I guess we'll wait. Um, wasn't our intent to, you know, have you guys call the cops, but since you did, we'll go ahead and stand by and wait. That's fine, but like I said, uh, that has nothing to do with the First Amendment. It has nothing to do with the freedom of the press. Um, that is usually an employee policy, not a public. And since this is a public lobby and taxes are paid, and you guys are paid by taxes, we have the right to record and do news stories. And like I said, the police will go ahead and let you know. You know, so that way you guys will be educated, and then if another crew comes in and want to blog you, you know, you guys will say, okay, you know, just let them be. You know, that's all it is. <clears throat> but you're very helpful. Thank you. I do appreciate that. If uh, when the police get here, we'll be right over at the next building over here. Okay. Thank you. All right. You didn't want to wait for the police. You didn't want to wait for the police. Huh? Okay. I want to see Hello, hello again. So, hey, question: Who would be the the, the manager? Well, sorry. The manager for this side. Yeah, give me one Oh, oh. Was the police still coming? Do you have more questions for me? Huh? Do you have more questions for well, me? Definitely check up on the police, see if they're still on their way. I talked to City Hall, and they said you guys are part of City Hall. So we, we just wanted to address this issue that you guys should never call the cops on public photography. Okay, it's not a crime. So she told me to come back and talk to the manager. 
Oh, I told her, no problems. We yeah. call just to make sure what yeah. we can legally say and what we can't legally say. Uh, okay, yeah. So, yeah, if people come in like us and we're just filming in the public lobby, it's not a crime. You guys don't have to call the cops. If, if you got somebody who's trying to go beyond, yeah, call the cops. Get them. Get them. Okay. Right? But, yeah, not us. You know what I'm saying? All right. All right. Thank you. Have a good yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He was real cool, yeah. That was an awesome experience. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Cool so, the finance department got an F. <laughs> they completely got an F. They wanted to call the cops for a protective activity for filming in public the uh, fire department public service building mm, a plus right. well yeah. well okay well you're right right because the, the females a little bit like i, I give i give the chief through the a plus he came in and yeah yeah that's what made me feel the a plus there yeah, um again, that's like maybe like an a like well, a minus a little bit just because those freaking chicks being a little dumb i'm gonna go with the a plus for me because yeah. Even though she did try to investigate, she didn't push the issue, right? And there's nothing wrong with investigating, you know, um, but like the uh, the finance department. I hey. like the way that that was. Yeah, that was really nice. Yeah, I, get, I, I would give him an A++. Because he came in like a boss and gave us a tour that was pretty cool this building unfortunately we seem like we can't get into it uh seems like they secured all the doors one of them i saw was only open monday like wednesday and friday though too yeah i'm not sure could be the same thing. And most of it might be shut down. Who knows? I see it like in the window here. You can see a lot of office spaces and nobody's in there. Uh, in the very beginning, when we first came in, there was some ladies sitting down on a computer and I was filming them and then the lady got up to try to close the blinds on me. What is all this stuff? So these are, these are, I guess, open documents for pickup. Who's picking up? Don't know. McDonald's. Okay. <coughs> yeah, so I'm not sure who's supposed to pick them up. New projects, USB. Hard copy papers, plans. So we talked about uh, public, I mean testing, COVID testing, which was cool.